This is Struggling to Succeed. In this week's episode, we're going to talk about another excellent lesson from the School of Stoicism. God laid down this law, saying, If you want some good, get it from yourself. Epic Titus Have you ever wondered how you have a good day? Have you ever taken the time to really think about why was that day a good day? In my life and in my struggling to succeed journey, I have thought about that a lot. I have struggled to really piece together why some days are better than others and why some days I feel like I've had a magnificent day and it's been excellent and I feel great going to bed at night, while other days it just doesn't seem to click. Have you ever thought about that? Well, in this episode, we're going to discuss the quote by Epictetus, where he basically says, if you want some good, get it from yourself. And when I used that quote and thought about my best days, a light went on. Ah, maybe on my best days, I was doing good things. When people discuss using Stoicism as an operating system for your life, I sometimes struggled with the concept of that. What do you mean, operating system? It's not like I can just plug in Steve 2.0 and go because I've read Meditations by Marcus Aurelius. It's not the way it quite works. However, by using some of the quotes and the words and the wisdom from the Stoics, you can get an upgrade because they do give you great tips and techniques about how to have a better life and how to have better days. And this very, very simple quote from Epictetus saying that if you want some good in your life, get it from yourself, which translates roughly into if you want to be good, do good things. So this allowed me to then go back out into my life after reading that quote and after realizing that my best days, I'm doing good things. And as an operating system on your day-to-day -day life, if you strive to actually do good things and respond in good ways to what happens to you, you end up having good days. Another way to look at this quote it's the old age saying that you get out of life what you put in. If you put in shit, panic, gossip, lies, deceit, and bullshit, what do you get out? Shit. But if you put in thoughtfulness, kind, energetic, motivated, positive words and actions, you'll get that at the end of your day or the opposite, or the reverse of that. So what you put into life, you get out. And this quote by Epictetus touched on that 2,000 years ago, touched on you put good in, you get good out. When you have, or when you can find positivity 80, 90, 95% of the time within yourself, when you can rely on the fact that you are out to fall on the better side of your personality and the better side of your thinking, it removes a lot of anxiety in your life because you're no longer relying on other people around you to be in good or positive moods. And in my journey, I have found this concept extremely helpful, especially working and going out into the world and not knowing what or whom I'm going to face, what news I'm going to hear about what some idiot is doing or saying on Twitter, what disasters struck at work, what has happened to my finances or my car or whatever situation or negative thing happens to me on that day. 
I know that because I can rely on my positive internal self. It doesn't really matter what somebody else says to me. It doesn't matter if other people at work are having an argument. I know that I can find the good within me mostly all the time. So that makes my life a little bit more bearable and survivable, survivable, if that's a word. Is survivable a word? I think it is a word. I'll keep going with it. That makes my day a little bit more survivable because I am able to dip into my well of healthy thoughts, my well of positivity, and that allows me to even spread that to other people who may not be having the best day. But that's when you can have good days. You can take this Epictetus quote about if you want to have a good day, find it from within yourself. That's what you can do on a daily basis. And because you can find it within yourself, there is the possibility that then you can infect other people around you with positivity, which allows them to have a better day. So you're increasing everybody's joy and everybody's happiness around you because you're relying on your good that you have inside yourself. That's it for me this week. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please go ahead and hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you can follow along and get lots more content on my struggling to succeed journey. My mission here is to deliver you weekly videos that hopefully can inspire you to start your journey of success. Thanks again for watching. Hope to see you next week. And as always, make it a good one.